Hi and welcome to Photoscore Ultimate Review. I did not find a Photoscore review on YouTube. I have tried Photoscore demo and hence able to review the software. It is too soon for Photoscore developers to call it ultimate when there are a lot of problems with the software. For example, Photoscore reads and processes music poorly. Example, uh, I'm going to now on the left side, I'm going to choose a music piece a landla there's it and I'll ask it to read so you can see on the left side is a bad timing navigator and there are lots of bad timing errors there which corresponds to the dotted line on the bars on the right side uh, so so it's not ultimate as it claims to be uh, it's a poor scanning I mean uh, reading of music there and and here it says scanning tips I tried all the scanning tips put up by Photoscore and but like Landler this piece of music other sheet music also had bad timing issues um, and I was very disappointed with the reading result in spite of uh, trying all the scanning tips for nearly 45 minutes I tried everything to reduce the bad timings here on the left side but um, it was the result was the same uh, uh, um, sharp eye reader however can read this um, piece of music called Landla much more accurately and with fewer errors I think it will be half of the bad timing errors no not even half quarter the timing errors here on the left side will be uh, I mean it will be there in the sharp eye reader program because when I played back the, the tune in sharp eye it, re um, it played back fairly accurately now the second problem is with the photo score is the tempo let me close this is the tempo uh, this program does not allow to set a tempo though you have the option by right clicking going to text and there's the tempo selection there so I click on tempo it does nothing meaning there's no dialog box uh, opening up to allow me to set a tempo so, I, so that's a disadvantage um, uh, the uh, third problem is cannot solo so let me close this uh, music score landla uh, and choose fast train I'm asking it to read fast train the piece of music and it's a duet piece uh, the tune fast train and what I cannot do in this music is fast train to paradise is I cannot um, solo the piece of music even though it's a duet beginners and advanced students need to be able to mute one part for example say mute part two so that they can play along with the solo part one if part one is soloed so that's a pity that I cannot solo a duet piece of music. Uh, the other thing is, uh, Photoscore, um, other problems, Photoscore uh, cursor highlights the whole bar as you play, as I'm playing it now. You can see the, you can see the whole bar there. Whole bar is being highlighted by the cursor. Uh, but in SmartScore, the cursor highlights each note during playback 
which is very good especially for beginners who do, don't know which notes actually are being played back so note highlight is much more which is much better for for them than the photo score which um, highlights the entire bar photo score developers asked to try this software in Sibelius 6 I installed Sibelius 6 in Vista but when I opened it opened the program all all that it was doing was coming up with a message saying creating toolbar and the message was there forever I left it on for half an hour 45 minutes but but that message didn't go obviously Sibelius 6 is not working maybe because it's a demo version with too many restrictions Photoscore also does not allow me to save music XML and NIFF as it's a demo version so, uh, so I don't know what the result would be when imported to another music program uh, so I can't review this, uh, this aspect of Photoscore I hope uh, you viewers will think twice before buying the program um, it is not the uh, it is not the best music scanning software yet I mean it's not the ultimate scanning software yet um, and next time I'll be reviewing in my next video I'll be reviewing sharp eye reader thank you for watching and bye